Today is the day you will officially lose all of your privacy. But what do I mean by this and why am I so doom and gloom? Well, WorldCoin officially launched. And if you don't know what WorldCoin is, you're going to want to hold on to your briefs because things are about to get absolutely terrifying. If you're brand new to the O Show, everything crypto and NFTs every day, I'm your host, Wendy O. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, set alerts, and please share this video out because everybody deserves to have access to this information. And as always, hear what I say, but listen to yourself and do additional due diligence. So what in the actual beep is WorldCoin? Okay. According to them, WorldCoin was created by Sam Altman, the same dude that created ChatGPT, you know, the AI tool that is absolutely taking over the world and destroying jobs. Well, things get a little bit better here. Well, more interesting, I should say. So basically, WorldCoin's technology is going to scan your eyeballs. So we're going to be using biometrics. They indicate on their website that this information will remain private, but I don't believe them in any way, shape or form, and you shouldn't either. Um, basically, they're going to be using a small device called an orb to scan people's eyeballs in order to generate a unique digital identity. And basically, they want to create a proof of personhood. In doing so, they want to essentially eliminate all of the bots because there is a big bot problem. And yes, I totally understand that. However, this is a crypto project and this project is in no way, shape or form decentralized any way, shape. Also, they are not available in the USA because of the insane laws and regulations we have, which good for now. However, some of the things that they're talking about on their website make me a little bit nervous, especially now that we have Fed now, which is basically infrastructure for the CBDC. That's my personal opinion. Straight from their website, WorldCoin consists of a privacy preserving digital identity, World ID, and where laws allow a digital currency, WLD, received simply for being human. We hope that where rules are less such clear as the US, steps will be taken so more people can benefit from both. So essentially they have a token affiliated with their project. They don't even really need a token in my personal opinion, but could this brand new token be the CBDC on a global scale? So if you download the world app and you do the biometric data and you give them your personal information, you get to prove that you're a real and unique person online while remaining completely private. That's 100% BS. They also have a customer service line as well. And how do you, these people are gonna actually have access to your data. No HIPAA training, no privacy training, just random people from what I'm seeing on their website, okay? Also too, as global distribution of orbs is ramping up, you can find the closest one and book time to be verified with World App at worldcoin.org. So you actually have to go somewhere and complete this process. You can't just do it from your mobile phone. Weird, right? And how are they gonna get these orbs everywhere? But wait, it gets better. Here's where UBI comes into play. UBI is also known as universal basic income. And this is scary. This is not something you want in any way, shape or form. Humans from the beginning of time have needed competition. If humans do not have competition, that basically means everybody's gonna get lazy and compliant and pretty much do whatever we're told to do, not be able to think for ourselves. Do to do, where is it? We're going to enable global democratic process and eventually show potential path AI funded UBI. So basically with WorldCoin, you get to go ahead and give your personal information. They're going to know everything about you and they want to institute a UBI. Well, what the heck is a UBI and how does this have to do with WorldCoin? Well, basically, once you give all your information, they're going to basically allow governments from all different parts of the world to have access to your information. UBI will, will 100% happen probably in the United States. It's going to happen on a global scale. And this is why the CBDC is so dangerous to me. This project is absolutely terrifying. It makes me nervous. I like to keep my privacy safe. I like to keep personal information about me safe and private because my business, some of the things I do in my personal life is not everybody else's business. But with a project like WorldCoin, with a CBDC, with UBI, everything is going to be made public in my personal opinion, especially when they're using our biometric data. And that is something you should definitely, definitely be concerned. Also too, since July 14th, they have recorded over 2 million signups. And the project did release a gas-free crypto wallet for verified humans. And it also says that to register for a world ID, you'd be asked to provide a phone number or an iris scan. Again, it's going to be your eyeballs that they're going to be scanning. They're not going to care about your phone number. So be very careful what information you read on the internet. Um, understand that we are getting a CBDC and this is going to be absolutely detrimental. And AI is going to be playing a big role with this project, which could be good, but really think is bad long term. So be very, very careful what information you give. Guard your biometric data as much as you can. And please, 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 please be careful out there. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, set alerts. Wendy is out. Bye-bye.